Pink snapper, yellowtail kingfish and even squid have been caught in decent numbers off Perth this week. Here's Mark Lacra with this week's Fish Watch. Well, it's been a big week for WA fishermen with some huge fish hitting the decks and an absolute monster catch from the depths with one of the toughest fish in the sea. Here's where they're biting. Around the Perth beaches, there are still loads of herring around as well as a few tailor coming from the local rock walls. There are still some salmon around, but not in big numbers, with a few caught from North Mole in Frio. Offshore, there are heaps of pink snapper biting behind Garden Island and around most of the inshore reefs, as well as some nice yellowtail kingfish that have responded well to a good burly trail. There have also been heaps of big squid out from the old power station in South Fremantle and around most inshore weed beds and marina rock walls. Up north at Kalbarri, evolution charters have been doing well on all the major species offshore, with red emperor, coral trout, bald chin groper and some nice sized dewfish all responding well to metal jigs, while trolling has produced the goods on some huge Spanish mackerel as well as cobia. From the shore the Murchison's been holding plenty of black brim and some good sized tailor have been caught on lures at the river mouth. Just south of town, Wago has had a few mulloway come from shore and an absolute ripper of a Spanish mackerel was caught over the weekend weighing in at around 20 kilos. And an unbelievable catch has come in from down south around the Albany area this week with angler Jethro Benicha having a four hour battle with an absolute monster swordfish that weighed 175.5 kilos. After dropping a fish earlier in the day, it was second time lucky, but it wasn't an easy job after they drifted 10 nautical miles in their six metre boat throughout the fight. These fish are such a rare catch and it's believed that this one is the biggest caught from WA and the first from our south coast. Well there you go, there's been some great captures sent into Fish Watch this year. But that swordfish would have to be right up there with the best of them. And I'm sure those boys will be reliving that story for years to come. I'll catch you next week. Mark Lacra, 9 News.